The city of San Francisco taking legal action on a new law that allows Uber and Lyft drivers to work anywhere in the state with just one permit. KPX 5's Wilson Walker has more on the lawsuit. This is about having uh, every business play by the same uh, set of rules, including Uber and Lyft. While it may have been filed against the state of California, this lawsuit actually drives right into the ride hailing industry, claiming that Senate Bill 182, passed last year, has allowed Uber and Lyft to usurp San Francisco's authority to regulate its own affairs. And what that state law does is basically carve out an exemption just for Uber and Lyft drivers and exempts them from local business registration uh, and, and tax purposes. Right now we have a law that says that everybody that runs a business in the city has to register with the city each year and pay a tax. That's city treasurer Jose Cisneros who is cooperating in this lawsuit, but in a sweeping statement announcing his action today, city attorney Dennis Herrera pointed to a long list of now familiar complaints, everything from clogged streets to dangerous driving. So why the very narrow scope of this lawsuit? Well, certainly there have been, you know, a lot of discussions by policymakers uh, across the political spectrum here in San Francisco about how to deal with the issue of these ride-hailing companies. You know, this lawsuit is really focused on one specific aspect of that, and that is these uh, companies, Uber and Lyft, creating a carve-out uh, for their drivers. For years now, critics have accused the city's political leadership of being too friendly with ride-hailing companies, but the city has said, hey, the state has claimed jurisdiction over all of this. Well. Here we have a lawsuit that goes directly to that question, just who has the authority to regulate what happens on city streets. In San Francisco, Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.